Okay, so this is Rachel, who's uh, probably a bit knackered. She's just finished her second day on the Permanent Makeup Startup course. And today we've been concentrating on brows, haven't we? That's right, yeah. And uh, this morning, first thing, we had a client in who um, Katie was going to be working on, but you ended up taking over because you were very confident. <laughs> um, and what was the client's background, actually, Rachel? Um, she's been a um, makeup artist for, and a beautician for the last 15 years. Right, okay. Um, and she's recently just trained in permanent makeup as well. Yeah, because she trained here, actually, I think just a couple of weeks ago, didn't yeah. she? So you, not the easiest of first clients to start working on. A professional makeup artist who's also trained in permanent makeup yeah. so we, we feel a bit nervous initially um, a little bit because <laughs> yeah I can imagine she probably she'll, she'll be quite particular about what she wants yeah. um, but once I, I got going I, I it felt quite confident okay lovely and I, I know normally Kate does the first client for you to see but you, you got in there and you did sort of the best part of an hour on her initially so um, how did it actually feel using the machine on a real person for the first time um, it felt very similar um, yeah. to using it on the practice. Uh, the practice sheets but what I think you have to get the build the confidence with is actually feeling the, the client's face and, and feeling confident about actually putting your hands on somebody that you don't really know yeah um and, and sort of moving it so that you're comfortable yeah um, so that was the sort of thing that I felt that I needed to okay build my confidence with Okay, brilliant. And then I had a bit of a lunch break, and then we had another client in, yep. which Kate sort of just started a, a few minutes here and there, and you did pretty much near enough the whole procedure. Yep. So you've done a good two and a half, nearly three hours worth of tattooing over across the whole day today, and you're only second day in. So yep. did you feel like you've been doing that straight away? Um, no, I really didn't think I would um, be doing this on my second day. Um, uh, but it's great, I'm loving it, and, and I can't wait to, to do more. Brilliant. And what was the client's sort of feedback? Anyway, how did the clients cope with you actually work? Because obviously you're a new person working, they know that. Yep. So how, 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 how were they comfortable, like the first and second clients? Um, first client, um, she was really good because she was very helpful at giving me feedback as um, how my feeling um, and confidence came across yep. in how I was handling her. I suppose um, she's done permanent makeup, so she knows and, right. and can, and yeah. a good position to give you it from both sides. Exactly. Yep. Um, so that was all very positive. And then the second client fell asleep <laughs> right. during the treatment. So hopefully okay. she was nice and relaxed. Okay, brilliant. And so she must have been confident then and, uh, and, and ha quite happy for you to do the treatment because yeah. uh, if she fought, fell asleep, then it just goes to show. Yeah. You, you, anyone, obviously, that was a little bit nervous themselves would, would certainly not be falling asleep. No. <laughs> okay, brilliant. And then I hope she woke up and, and liked her brows then. Yes, she certainly did. <laughs> Okay, fantastic. So you've had a good, really good second day. Yeah. And how have you found the sort of uh, the training so far, like the first couple of days? How has it sort of flown from sort of actually learning the, the theory side, which obviously you learned a little bit beforehand as well yeah. before you came with the pre-study, to actually practicing? And then has it been a sort of a natural progression for you? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think doing the, the pre-study was... Um, was perfect because yeah. you get a, um, the background basics first um, and you have a little bit of an understanding um, of what's going on yeah. and then when you come here and get to speak to Katie um, you can things start falling into place yeah. um, and you start understanding the process an awful lot more um, and she also makes makes things um, a lot more simple for you to understand and so something that seems perhaps quite complex yeah. actually can be simplified quite dramatically yeah um, so it's yeah the progression has been um, good okay brilliant and, and good results as well yeah excellent well enjoy a good night's sleep tonight maybe a glass of wine who knows <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll look forward to catching up with you shortly lovely thank cool. you very much cheers Rachel